Hey guys, what's up? This is Travis, and this is my new YouTube channel. So the first thing I want to talk about, as a lot of you guys are probably coming from Toxroid, my Instagram account, and we just recently hit 4,000 followers, which is awesome. I hope you guys keep enjoying the content. Leave a comment to talk about Toxroid on the bottom if you want. That would be cool. So let's get right into the video. All right, guys, so this is my personal build. Um, it's built inside the Corsair 450D. It's an Obsidian line case, and I love this case. It looks great. It's clean. The only problem I had with it is it seems a little bit, how do you say, it's flimsy compared to many other Corsair Obsidian cases like the 900D and the 750D. Let's talk about the processor that I have in this computer. So I have the 4670K, uh, it's a great processor, and please forgive me guys, I know I have the stock cooler in here, but I'm going to be grabbing the Corsair H110i GT as soon as it comes out and I can get, afford it and get my hands on it. So hopefully I can get that by the end of this month and do a review on it on this channel hopefully. So maybe I can get some overclocking done on there then for video editing, seeing that I only have an i5 right now and I'm gonna start getting into video on this YouTube channel. So the two graphics cards I have in this computer, they, in my opinion they look pretty awesome and they're ridiculously fast. Right now I'm using dual AMD R9 290s. Uh, these are the Sapphire Vapor X edition and these things are just screaming fast. Um, I have a 1080p monitor right now and these can max out every game in 1080p easily and so unfortunately the second one right now I'm just borrowing from a friend so I'll have to return that at some point but if only one 290 is still fine for me seeing that I'm only running at the 1080p monitor a great thing I love about these graphics cards too is that they are so much cooler than the reference design both of these together uh, they've never hit 80 degrees while gaming Whereas with a normal reference design, just one card would end up a lot of times thermal throttling when it hit 95 degrees Celsius. And the power supply is the Corsair RM850. A little bit overkill for just one graphics card, but in the future, like I have right now, I am crossfired. And if I buy a card myself after I turn this card to my friend, it really just gives me enough power to crossfire. So that was the main thing. It's uh, 80 plus gold, so efficient power supply and fully modular and nice black sleeved cables. So... I like that about it a lot too. I've just got 8 gigs of RAM in right now, but I think it will upgrade to 16 for video, of course. It's the Corsair Vengeance Pro, and I got the blue ones. I think it looks really nice, matches the rest of my system really well. The motherboard that I have is the ASRock Z97 Extreme 4. It's a really great motherboard. It does what I need it to do. It's blue, matches my system. It was important. I was looking at color scheme in this build a lot. It's got USB 3.0, fits my processor, it's got PCI Express and a few cool little handy dandy things that are built into some software that you can download online. If we talk about storage a little bit, I have one OCZ Vertex 3 SSD in the back right behind the motherboard and that is 240 gigabytes. I put all my main programs like Adobe Lightroom for photos, Premiere Pro for video, and Windows on that of course. Then I have a one terabyte WD Blue hard drive and that just sits over here normally but I had to take it out because of the second graphics card right now. So that's just a terabyte, holds my games. I think I'm gonna have to upgrade because I'm working with video now. So a lot of upgrades, as you can probably tell by this video, are gonna have to come around by this video editing. But you know, it is what it is. And I think that is about it with my build. So if you guys want me to do a little bit more in-depth on the build, just tell me in the comments. And I hope I did a pretty good job. All right, now that I'm done talking about my computer, which is the main topic of this video, I just have a little more I wanna talk about. One, I want to talk about my Instagram account, Toxroid, and I also want to talk a little bit more about this new YouTube channel. So if you don't know my Instagram account, Toxroid, I post a picture to every day of PCs that you guys submit directly to me via direct message. And that has been going really great. As I stated previously, we already have 4,000 followers, which is really awesome, and I hope to keep that community growing. And there's all kinds of great discussion that goes on there in the comment section. And then I also now want to talk about this YouTube channel. So now that I have this, um, I plan on doing two videos every week, which one would be a new segment and one would be a review or a build or a tutorial or something like that. So if you guys want to see something different than that, leave let me know. Just tell me in the bottom below. But the main thing is, is I really need your guys' feedback about these videos that I'm creating because I'm just starting out. I want to know what you guys want to see and what you think I can improve on because obviously this is my first video. It was probably not perfect. So just tell me down below again in the comments. I just want to know like what you think I could improve on and what you want to see from this channel because I think it's really important to see what you guys want and really 
try to build this channel off that. And I think that's about it, guys. I thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you subscribe. I hope you comment down below. That's the most important thing. And if you like this video, give it a like. I really appreciate it. And that's about it. Thanks, guys. I'll see you in the next one.